to living your best life. Always. Wish you all the best forever. Good morning in the morning because it's my birthday and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time joining us, welcome, welcome, welcome to it. I really do hope that you stay, you subscribe and you become a part of the it's family. Guys, 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 it's my birthday. It's the 4th of October. I thought what better way to get straight back into my vlogging um bag than to create a birthday vlog um every single year i do these birthday vlogs you guys know if you guys haven't watched any of my other birthday vlogs go and search zx online birthday because i've documented my birthday now for probably the past wow millions of years i swear <laughs> since i was in Boston. so guys definitely check that out if you guys want to watch my other birthday vlogs but today is the 4th of october 2022 my 25th birthday um Feeling super grateful to be alive, happy to be alive, feeling blessed, so, so, so blessed. When I look past the last year, I'm just like, wow, I really come such a long way. This year has been amazing for my growth. This year, I've achieved a lot. I bought my car, I got my first born. Crazy. Guys, the more I th every single time I think about it, I'm like, that was literally a few months ago. Literally, that's crazy business. I got my first born Grace, who I love so much. And thank God for every day because, wow, what a blessing. What a freaking blessing. Guys, sometimes I just sit in that car and I'm like, wow. I put myself in my car. Ah! Anyways, like, yeah, there have been so many blessings this year um, that I'm just so grateful for. I feel like I feel so ready to be 25. I feel like I'm in a phase of my life where I'm really ready to walk into a new chapter and just change my life for the better, honestly. Like, I'm just super motivated, feeling super happy and just super calm. More than anything else, I just feel calm. I feel like on all my other birthdays, because I've been doing rocking spree and I've been like <laughs> rocking back to back for like at least a week. I feel like I don't feel calm on my birthday, but this birthday, I honestly haven't done much of anything. I was at a wedding this past weekend, which I've been super tired from. I won't even lie to you, but I just feel like today I'm super calm. I'm very good with the flow. I'm very much like mm, whatever, you know, and for the longest time of, I was saying like, you know what? You can't end it off about this birthday. Like you can't end it off because I don't know, like things were just all over the place. I didn't feel centered. I felt like also like I didn't have like a, um, chance to sort of like reflect and like really sit in my thoughts before my birthday so i just felt incredibly off balance like in life i've just felt a little bit you know like i'm a libra so things need to be in balance and like i felt very much do, 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 all over the place so yeah i also feel like i'm in my the stage where like i really my manifestations and the things that i speak out of my mouth I need to watch them because a lot of the times like i'm manifesting things very literally into my life so even me saying that i feel like i couldn't do off about this birthday i need to stop saying that and just like you know be in the moment if anything doesn't go my way i just need to go with the flow and like rock with it this year i'm not doing anything wild or crazy for my birthday because i'm going to be doing something super exciting next week uh you guys will see because i will be taking you guys with me because we're back in our vlogging bag so today is like a very chilled chilled day i'm so sad guys because snee isn't here with me on my birthday this year and i think we've literally spent every single birthday together since we like started our friendship which was years ago i think it was at least six seven years ago which is just like so sad so i just like want to cry but you know what that aside today is gonna be a great day um basically right now i'm going to the gym i was telling my trainer like we need to train my birthday we need to set the tone we need to set the tone for 25 snatch goals worldwide so i'm gonna go to the gym and then following that i'm going to take the car to the car wash i think um grace needs a little bit of a pamper because you know what she was my gift to myself for my 25th birthday so she needs to get washed also just because she's dirty since i've left her here for a week uh just collecting dust so that's gonna happen and then after that i'm just gonna come home take a shower then i'm gonna take myself out for a little like lunch brunch when i do that i think i might pop into santon afterwards because i want to get a skirt for the outfit i want to wear tonight tonight we're going 
to dinner we're going to tang just to have a quick dinner, and that's basically gonna be my whole day guys um so yeah let me run to the gym because i have 15 minutes to get there i don't want to be late latism is something we are leaving at 24 so let's go <laughs> about that the radio but yeah the gym is done i'm a great session i'm literally obsessed with boxing guys i want to be a boxing like i just want to be boxing leave everything else and focusing on boxing but <laughs> all that being said i think let's go wash the car now i also forgot guys that there's literally a car wash right by the gym and i definitely could have left my car there so that's awkward and a huge l for me but you know what maybe i need to be inside gracie when she's getting washed maybe that was the the, the program for the day also guys what a bad omen i'm literally on my period on my birthday my period like started today like the actual period yesterday i was like it was like my pre cramps or whatever today is like the full blown period i was like what are the odds but you know what i'm just happy that it's happening before next week actually because that is when i really don't need to have my period so maybe this is a blessing in disguise i don't know but anyways uh let's head to Guys, so I've made it to the car wash. I'll show you guys in a second. I just ran into the shops to get myself some bolts. So I haven't eaten anything the whole day, and my period is I can feel it like the cramps are cramping, the vibes are vibing. So I'm like, you know what, let me get some. It's iron, eh? <laughs> let me get my iron up so that maybe I will feel less like I'm gonna pass out. Also, I've had to put like the aircon on full blast. Yeah, Shona, really, really, and truly, guys, 25. I can feel it. I'm not the same young tenderoni that I was yesterday. Let me just tell you that. I I don't feel the same. I feel different. I feel brand banking. <laughs> Anyways, guys, um, I'm literally about to sit here and watch um, the stuff that people are posting on their stories. I just watched the beginning of Leah's and it's so cute. So I was like, ah! I need to literally focus my attention on eating these sticks and watching these stories. Um, yeah. <laughs> Hi guys, well majority of this vlog today be in the car perhaps but basically I'm about to go and scoop Lanzi so we can go to Olives and Plates. Damn, it's so late. Damn. Anyways, <laughs> let me head because I'm late as fuck. Also, I don't know what took me so long here. Hey? Who knows? But I said I was going to be better with latism when I'm 25. Clearly, I'm a big fat liar. I'm a big fat burger. But anyways, I'll see you guys. Probably at Olives and Plates because... <laughs> We are at Olive's in place. Ding, ding. Ding, ding. Happy birthday exactly. to you. Yeah, well, it's pretty. This is lovely. But guys, we're here and it's boiling. When I tell you, boiler. I couldn't actually believe I feel like it's hotter in here than it is on outside, though. I mean, what? inside. Did you say on side? <laughs> older than it's a hot day. Hey, older than I was telling you, I'm older than what? But not what? Ooh. Somebody. 
Ooh. Maybe you need to eat. Oh, nah, need enjoy. Enjoy. Oh, and literally, I haven't eaten the whole day, so perhaps I should do that. But anyways, I met <laughs> older but not wiser because I was so late to fetch land. Well. Jimmy, of course, you're gonna but be like, late like, I won't be. I'm gonna change this to seven, I think. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only way I'm gonna make it. In other words, no, you're gonna be late. I already know now that it's going to be late, so I was just like, you know what? I was like, that was going to change that shit to seven. Because, yeah, that'd be a bit awkward. I think <laughs> she's going to Happy birthday, Chomi. Oh, Love you so much. Wait, to 25 more years. Period. 25 on top of that. Period. To and that's enough 25. So 25, 25 million good. times 25 million. Period. To 25 more opportunities. Period. Times 25 more opportunities. Period. And to live in our best life. Always. Wish you all the best. Forever. All the best. Love you loads. Mm. Mama says, as we should. Please wish Zama happy birthday right now. Um, she will leave her PayPal and account. Exactly. In Actually, the guys, box. don't look for her PayPal details. My email address. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't. I don't want to take it. I don't want to take you guys for email address. Just use that. That's where it is. Use it. And don't abuse. Don't limit yourself. Literally. Feel free. Don't feel like you should stop. Feel like you should carry on. Like, do the most. Go wild. It's up to tease me all the time about being 25. But I told her that even Lissetti said the same thing to me this morning. I said, guys, you're still going to be 26 before me. And then you'll be 27 before me. When you were like, it's going to be April soon. It's like, you're older than me. I'm like, for so many months. Like, you're older than me. You're so many months. <laughs> Happy birthday, ZX Online! I'm dead at singing at the same time, it's so sweet. Thank you guys, this was the next level. Guys, I'm sitting in traffic, I'm in a hall, but I'm five minutes away from my house. Um, Lance will think I'm going to be late again. Joke's on her, because I'm going to be on time. Hopefully. <laughs> Honestly, guys, the only thing I have to do is my makeup. So if I'm late again, lock me up. Lock me up, Your Honor. So yeah, all the best. Come see you guys when you get home. <laughs> Hi guys, we are at Tang. Um, I didn't show you guys me getting ready because I was charging the camera and with like as he said. So I couldn't even show you guys that, unfortunately. However, we are at Tang. I'm serious? with. Okay, I'm, I'm very serious. I'm so serious. Yeah, explain. I'm, so Yo. <laughs> I'm sitting here with Lozers. I'm with Lanswell again. Unfortunately me. for me, Chubby, you don't have a it's choice. her. Okay. What? Okay. And then, <laughs> let's see you come closer. Oh. Someone said they like my TX thingies that I do. Oh, the TX. But anyway, please. <laughs> Yeah, we are about to have them too. Tato's gonna join us a little bit later, so it's Snizzle. See? When we catch if you. We catch you. No, we will catch her. You're right. When? We ca also when I catch up a pussy, all those throwbacks of me. When I catch you for that. Jerry, that was the highlight. <laughs> When them see the lyrics come chucked up, come me in a corrupt side, and everybody get chucked up. Play sing for black daddy top side. When them see the lyrics come chucked up, come fi come in a corrupt side, and everybody get chucked up. Play sing for black daddy top side. When them see the lyrics come chucked up, come fi come in a corrupt side. Look at that. I got it. Did you get the mini smoky I did? Oh, what's that? Yes. For her to stop being a fool, actually. For her to stop being a fool. Because Zama is a biggest fool. I'm sorry. Zama is the biggest fool. I need you to unfool yourself. I need you to unfool yourself. Oh, 
it's definitely more blessing. Amen. Abundant. Amen. I mean, I mean, it's been quite interesting. I was thinking about it today. I'm like, um, I met Zama at another working space, and like, oh, yes. <laughs> long ago with you know that woman. Hey. Oh, and I was actually like, look at us. Hey. Look at us. And like we're watching each other transform, and as the years go on, it's like the blessings are coming. So all you wish for in the next year is times ten. Love that. Thank you, Thank you so much. Love you, love Kesi. Hey, man. I'm cool. Yes, <laughs> Zulu. My I'm last cool. name is Francis. But generally, um, my wish for you is I'm always facing your heart's desires. Amen. Um, I think you're a prayer warrior. Muri muri, just give me some easy You know what I'm saying? So your heart's desires, um, more money, more blessings, more travels, a prairie, more chicken. Yeah. That's my birthday wish on myself. That's my biggest wish for tonight. But also, I do wish everything that you ever want in your life. Especially work wise, because you work so hard. You're so intelligent. Comes into fruition. I hope you get married so you can have kids so I can be a rich aunt. Period. More traveling, and I hope you receive the love that you get. Because you're so thoughtful, you're so loving, and just support and you're hilarious. Hi guys, so I just got back from dinner with the girls. It was super cute. Um, I'm doing an early night in guys. I'm so incredibly tired. I wonder when I will stop being tired. Like I, I just want to know when I will stop feeling this immense fatigue that has been like running my life i also think um because obviously i was away the whole week last week like and we were actually doing stuff every day if it's not traveling we were running errands like we were doing stuff quite literally every single day so i think i'm just so i have like fatigue tomorrow i would like to sleep the whole day i'm not getting out of bed i'm not trying to do any work go to the gym I know Jay Sands will not be happy to hear about that <laughs> because I'm so tired. Wow. 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 But all in all, I had a really, really nice day. I think my day was just super chill, super calm. Um, I love spending time with my girlfriends. You guys know, like, I'm literally, I believe in my friends more than I believe in my black dreams. I have literally the best friends in the universe i feel like friendship is just where the true love is and as i was having that really inspirational talk with you guys about how much i love friendship you can see that escom does what it does and what's confusing me is like i feel like i just had load shedding when i left my house there was load shedding i'm back at home i spent about five seconds talking to you guys i'm being load shed again like do i really deserve this i can't say that i do but anyways guys, since we can't see each other anymore, I will talk to you guys in the morning. Let me go and take my makeup off and do what I have to do before I go to bed. Um, but I love you guys so much and we are going to continue this vlog because I feel like this week is going to be a little bit cute and eventful. So I'm going to take you guys along with me. If you guys are not from South Africa, I'll explain to you guys tomorrow or maybe like another day, another life because Jay, I am depressed right now. So gotta go. <laughs> Good. Morning, it is a new day. Today is Thursday. We skipped the 5th of October just because, guys, I don't know what it was. If it was birthday depression or just, I don't know. I was down so badly. Also, obviously, because I think it was on my period as well. Like, I think my emotions were just overwhelming me. I was just so sad. <laughs> Saying it's a little bit insane. Like, I was so sad. I just received some really shit news. Like, Yesterday was just not, it was not the vibe. So I was like, you know, it doesn't really make sense to vlog. I was in bed the whole day and I'm not even exaggerating. Like I literally did not leave my bed all day. So I didn't vlog, but today's a new day. I'm feeling much better this morning. Not wholly better, but 
much better than I was feeling yesterday. Um, I'm about to go to the gym. I feel like that will give me some of the endorphins that I need to pick up the pace. But yeah, I'm about to head to the gym. Then I'm going to come back, clean up a little, and then get ready for the rest of my day. This evening, we are going to a little dinner um, hosted by Tools at Greenhouse. And all the girls are going to be coming through. So that should be really fun. So yeah, I'll see you guys when I get to the gym. Probably won't vlog today at the gym, to be honest, because administration so i'll see you guys when i get back one eternity later back like a bag from the gym guys i look hot ass mess but i also went to go and buy some groceries so we're gonna do a grocery haul i haven't done this in so long also let me show you the video that i just posted on my instagram on my stories if you're not following me there go and follow me Ooh. yeah that ass no guys wow scary scary girl i'm a scary girl i'm afraid of my damn self you guys are gonna be sick of me this summer prepare right now to be sick of me <laughs> guys honestly it's so crazy how far into my gym bag i am right now i even have a physique in mind like i'm trying to get do you see that do you do you see this do you see those guns bro do you see those guns i'm trying to look like the rock Dwayne Johnson, I need to look like The Rock, guys, soon, soon, me and The Rock, me and The Rock, I'm joking, guys, but generally, I want to be a buff girl, like, I used to be like, oh, I don't want to train this, I don't want to train that, because I don't want to be buff, now it's all I want in my life, like, being buff, con in the on, icon in the on, um, I got rice cakes, then I got green tea. I don't know why it is taking me so long. I feel like every single time I went to the shop, I kept forgetting to get this. So I was on my backup reserve. So I got more of this. Then we got sparkling water. In my life, I have had to include this in my weekly groceries because I'm just addicted to electricity. And remember, guys, when I never used to drink it, like the real OGs will know. I only started drinking it in like 2020, I think. Yeah. Um, sriracha chicken noodles. Just got these. I don't want to get anything too hectic, guys, because I am going on a trip i probably haven't said that but yeah the thing that i'm doing next week is i'm going on a trip and they i don't want to buy too much food because i don't want it to go off then i bought myself some pineapple i've been needing fruits in my system so i got that and i also got this mango medley from woolies i bought everything from woolies i didn't feel like shopping i wanted to get in and get the fuck out <laughs> then i got this greek salad mix from Woolworths is what? Why, why am I telling you where it's from when everything's from Woolworths? Got this Greek salad mix. I normally get two meals out of this, so I'm just going to probably add some tuna and an egg, and this is a meal. Two meals. Dunzos. I love that for me, and I'm also very deep into my salad bag, guys. I love me a good salad, specifically because it's so hot. So refreshing, delicious. Love it for myself. Um, and then I got just this um, Chia Plus. Um, juice it has kiwi spinach mint you guys have seen me get this before really really helps things to flow in my body and that's kind of what i need today and every day really before my trip um and then i got this yogurt it is this full cream yogurt free from lactose have not had this before this is literally my first time getting this from woolies i'm interested to see how it's going to taste i love woolies yogurt in general i decided to get the 500 grams because i contrary to my own belief i won't even say popular belief my own belief i'm not going to finish a 1kg in a few days i'm not i'm just not going to do that so let me be a responsible adult and get the 500 grams something that i'm going to finish and that is not going to go to waste then i got um these avos this is just to add in my salad and if i want to make like rice cakes with avo i can do that as well with this have you guys noticed how i've let cheese go in my diet like as in i don't buy it as my groceries anymore and like i'm so sad about it i'm so sad like i miss cheese every day of my life then i got some panados mostly because um i'm hosting tonight at nostra <laughs> And my panados are finished, so I need those. This past weekend, I was at my cousin's wedding, as I mentioned um, earlier in this vlog. And all my cousins love grandpa. I obviously don't take it because Dr. Cindy told us on Twitter that it's basically like cocaine. So personally, won't be participating. But I thought, I just found it was so crazy. Like, my cousins aside, like everybody else, like grandpa's like a part of the culture. Why? Like, I never have like ever considered to get grandpa a day in my life. But anyways, got panados. And then 
I got this snack thing. I always buy this from Woolworths. I have no idea why. Mostly though, because I always go to Woolworths after gym and I'm hungry as nuts. So I always end up getting these. But if I don't eat them in the car, like I don't know when else I'm going to eat them. So I just bought them though. It's basically just... Um, cheese nibbles yeah cheese nibbles i said that i don't buy this as my groceries which is the truth i buy these as snacks so don't at me okay and then i just had to disappoint myself and buy my faves guys i have the biggest sweet twos in shabbing i believe in sweets more than i believe in my black dreams honestly but anyways um yeah that is my grocery haul done i want to curl the hair that i'm going to be wearing tonight i'm going to be wearing a little bob you guys know that bob um it's like a brown bob with highlights body wave vibes it's very sexy fun and flirty i'm gonna wear that to the dinner that we are all going to and then after that i'm going to change i think i'm gonna change i'm gonna decide how i feel when i get there if i want to change or not um but if i do i'm just gonna change into this little two-piece um for my hosting at nostra since nostra is not far from my house i'm thinking i'm probably gonna change i'm probably gonna change but anyways um i'm thinking also of filming a video i don't know if i'm being ambitious entertainment considering i do have load shading pretty but also i'm thinking i literally just have to curl this wig and then that's it. but also you know what maybe Monday's day again and not film that video today and film when I have braids on so that everything is in order I am going to be starting a new vlog tomorrow because it's gonna be preparation for battery, battery. but guys this oh this trip is giving me so much stress when I tell you guys I'm gonna put everything probably in the first vlog for that but you guys are going to vomit when I tell you the stuff I've been through the stuff i've been through but you know what god is faithful at the end of the day god is bigger and god is god in the end of the day so yeah anyways guys ttyl when i'm doing something that is interesting <laughs> hey guys as i'm sure you can tell i've done my hair i know it looks stupid right now but don't worry it'll make sense when the electricity comes back <laughs> and um i just need to comb it out the these parts i kind of just let them be because when i combed it out initially i didn't really like how the curls were sitting so i just recurled it and left it like this guys behind me it's my Shein order that i just received guys i ordered it so last minute i was literally holding my breath for if this order was gonna come and it's here it's here i'm so happy i have one more order though from Shein that needs to come through hopefully it'll be here at least by tomorrow hoping also i don't understand how they didn't just come together i ordered these things on the same day just one in the morning one like towards the evening why pray tell are they not coming at the same time also considering i paid customs if not the same day one day apart so baby bring my other package the other package wasn't as important because it's mostly just like is it i think it's just shoes and like accessories so i was like you know what if it doesn't come i won't die but if the first package doesn't come <laughs> I need to stay my ass at home. I need to stay at home because I have no clothes. So at least I'm up right now. I also have another package that I ordered from Wholesale 7. I would love to pay for it. However, I can't find my wallet. So that's fun. I literally have been looking for my wallet for a while now. I'm going to tidy up again and see if I can find it. But if not, I don't know what is going to happen. Because what am I actually like? Sanjua. Yeah. <laughs> Yemo Yemo What a song Let me pause it though It's the Masa copyright Also there was apparently Or there is rather A new Like Thing that's gonna come in Which says that we can use Copyrighted music However The person Who owns the music Gets paid as well Something like that So hopefully that happens soon But for now We can't listen to that Anyways guys I am done doing my makeup As you can see Something light I'm obsessed with these lashes guys Can't even tell you where I got them from Because I got them when I was doing my makeup With Glam Life Beauty And I actually low-key want to ask her Where she gets her lashes from Because these ones I've been wearing them Every single chance That I get <laughs> Yeah I'm done with my hair I'm done with my makeup I'm pretty much done with everything I was just stalling Changing Because the other girls Are not ready it lands was ready though so i think low-key i'm gonna pack my bags and hit the road and go pick her up um 
so that we can head i went down my lips yet because i was like busy doing a lot of stuff eating drinking doing a lot so i think i'm gonna do it now then head out guys i'm so hot i'm so hot i was just thinking about the fact that like guys i've drank so much water today my body is 100 percent water there's nothing left hey love can you hi guys it's me again we made it but at what black cost and we're not as late as i thought we'd be yeah, but also we weren't late because of ourselves today. True. It was everybody else. We and the fact that they're still at their homes lost crazy. their minds. And when they watch this. Silly city, you guys are I'm insane. Smack you. Smack you. Crazy, crazy you. business. Daisies. I'm with Yolanda and this is Cindy, as you guys can see and we're about to go in now it's quite it's a lot later than we thought we'd get here but also apparently Kelani's only going on at 11 so we're actually very early early is nuts I have the lineup because I have the app okay cool you so you, ha you have you the Rock in the Daisies, Daisies lineup yeah I mean Rock in the Daisies app oh quick it yeah, well, the the Anyways, so organization I am so deep. let's go into the beast. Oh, the usual man who comes to sweep my yard. The yard man. I like that broomstick you're carrying. Yes, baby. I like it. Hey.
guys i'm back from the festival oh my goodness i had a really cute time guys i don't know i didn't really have like super high expectations if i'm actually being honest with you because um i knew the joba content was going to be significantly smaller than the cape town one but it was cute um more than anything else i just think i have had fun with my friends um company really like made the biggest difference for me today like we had so much fun together um the maybelline store was cute it was cute um and the performances were great i will say though they didn't give us a lot of like south african stuff local stuff that i knew anyways maybe they were there i didn't know them if they were there so honestly Aside for Kehlani, I don't know any of those performers. I don't know those people. I don't want to make you think I knew them. I did not know who those people were. But Kehlani's performance at the end was cute. Did I feel like it would have been worth me buying a ticket? Absolutely not. Like, had I spent my hard-earned black coins buying a ticket, I would have been hurt. I will say that. And I just feel like, in general, the concert... I will say, like, the concert as a whole... Obviously, because I have to compare it to Cape Town, because I've obviously been to the Cape Town Daisies, and you guys know, um, all the real ones, no, that I literally used to go to Daisies every year. I think I've been to three Daisies, if I'm not mistaken, and I had a really good time there. It's always well organized, as my this one as well. It's very well organized, and also I was like comparing it to DSTV Delicious Festival, obviously because I went there, and that was a shit show. So going to daisies where it's a well-oiled machine getting in getting out like everything is just very on point like i love going there the experience is always amazing but i had to compare Joburg to cape town that thing doesn't give what cape town gives i don't want to lie to you guys that's why i'm saying like i don't know if i'd go again because if i want to go to daisies i just need to pack my bags and go to cape town the daisies and Joburg thing doesn't give like it doesn't give but obviously i was working so each job is a job and i'm glad i got to see like firsthand so i never have fomo for it if the lineup was good enough maybe i would bang it and just you know come a bit later because yeah come spending the whole day they didn't give because i didn't know those people who were performing like why couldn't they have at least given us blackie it doesn't make sense like the only person you're giving us the only headliner we're getting is kelani blackie literally lives in south africa we see Blackie at Nostra. Why don't you put Blackie on stage? I, what about this Tomaska Blackie? Like, also, guys, I met so many subbies at Daisy's. I don't actually remember the last time I met so many of you guys in one place. Oh my goodness, that was amazing. I love you guys so much. You guys had amazing energy. Like, it was great. I love you guys so much. Please comment down below if you saw me at Daisy's today. And just let me know i would love to say hi to you guys in the comments um you guys are amazing and i really always appreciate the energy you guys bring it always makes me feel like wow i'm doing the right thing somewhere somehow you can't do it on you can't do it on and thank you so much guys for the affirmations always i really appreciate it and thank you just in general for sharing having great conversation with me you guys rock zx family till the end baby um i have quite a long week ahead of me so i'm really tired but i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog if you did please don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and finally don't forget to subscribe to my channel we are on the road to 100,000 subscribers period we reached 80k and yeah we'll pass 81 i think now so we're moving and shaking candlestick making guys thank you i love you so much i don't think i've let you guys know that like thank you so much for 80k but i feel like i need to do it again in the next video because this is at the end so i need you guys to hear it for those who didn't make it to the end although i don't know why they didn't make it yeah awkward anyways see you on my next video